आप सुन रहे हैं रेडियो वन फोर पॉइंट टू एफ एम योर म्यूजिक योर बीट्स मैं हूँ जस्ट जूही एंड इट्स टाइम दैट वी टॉक टू समन वेरी स्पेशल वेल कॉम्बैटिंग कोविड नाइन्टीन इज अ शेयर रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी एंड द इन्फॉर्मेशन एंड ई गवर्नमेंट अथॉरिटी एनकरेजेस द कम्युनिटी टू प्ले एन इम्पॉर्टेंट रोल इन द प्रोसेस द आई जी ए एक्सप्रेसिस इट्स एप्रिसिएशन टू द थर्टी वॉलंटियर्स हु वर्क अलॉन्ग साइड इट्स टीम टू स्प्रेड अवेयरनेस ऑफ द बी अवेयर एप and today we are pleased to host shahad abdul razak a volunteer who will be talking about her experience with us first of all we'd like to thank you for your initiative and support during these exceptional circumstances abdul razak please tell us more about the motivation behind your volunteering how are you doing shahad yeah hi uh, thank you for hosting me today i'm It's... honored to be here uh, our love for the kingdom of bahrain is our main motivation for the volunteering Absolutely. The coronavirus yeah the coronavirus has affected everyone without exception so we were wanted to, uh, to support national efforts to overcome its challenges and their effects by supporting where we are needed many of the front lines are sacrificing their time and health to protect our community and our role is to support them even if just in a small way Uh, alhamdulillah we got the opportunity to volunteer through the national volunteer platform and i'm happy i was selected and called Shahad Abdul Razak is speaking to us we are hosting her on radio 104.2 FM who's a volunteer and she's sharing her experience of doing this exceptional work at this exceptional circumstance well may Allah bless your efforts Shahad and the efforts of the other 29 volunteers tell us more about the task that you undertook as volunteers working with information and e-government authority we were uh, contacted after registering on the volunteer portal the information and e-government authority prepared us to take on the assigned tasks through a series of property visual meetings and training sessions on how to use the be aware bahrain application we were briefed on the process and conditions under which we would be required to work and trained on using the be aware app and on, on its technicalities everyone in the kingdom citizens and residents can download the application from the government app store and register several team provide support to the app users briefly the application is notifying individuals in the event they are approaching a location where an active case has been detected or if they were in close proximity with an active confirmed case it also allows self isolation individuals to book their exit test appointment and highlight official local and international statistics on covid-19 developments and notifications to the public we are divided into three teams okay the first team located in bahrain international airport assists people traveling into the kingdom by explaining how to download and activate the app and register in it by their id card or passport number The team briefs them on the features, explains how to use it during their self-isolation period, and provides technical support to the administrative team for the arrival registration process. The second team is stationed at the Bahrain International Exhibition and Convention Center. They brief users on the features of the Be Aware Bahrain mobile app and the e-service it offers. The third virtual team. provides technical support to the applications users by responding to technical inquiries in coordination with the ministry of health call center trouble four personally i work with igl volunteer team well i must say shahad first of all a lot of appreciation to the entire team at iga also because the be aware app we can't stop talking about it on radio 104.2 fm is such a, yeah. an initiative which is you know so helpful for everyone who's using it getting the information now yeah. this has become a habit when i leave home and i reach home back i always get that notification and i always check on it and thankfully i have not been in close proximity to any active case which is so helpful oh God, secondly yeah. i would say you and 29 other volunteers who have been working with iga the youth of bahrain like we keep saying you know under the wise leadership is doing such a great job so congratulations for that work and you're inspiring many others yeah. Can you Shahad also tell us about your experience as a volunteer how did it impact you and did you benefit from it Well the experience had a positive impact on me 
being a volunteer and helping to fight the separate of the coronavirus is a source of pride for me and my fellow volunteers. We feel content that we played a socially responsible role and contributed to protecting the nation. On a professional level, we gained new friends and colleagues and become acquainted with types of work that are different from our regular careers. We also got to see how the information and e-government authority works and how Bahrain created such an innovative application. Absolutely. Very well said, Shahad. Shahad, there's no doubt that volunteer work, especially on a national level, benefits the community. What would you like to tell young people who are listening to you at this minute about the value of volunteer work? Many of you have a lot of free time and would undoubtedly like to return to your normal, normal routines, going out with your friends to the malls and restaurants. So if you would like to return to your regular life faster, take any opportunity to volunteer and contribute to the community by helping it to overcome this pandemic. By supporting the community, you support yourself, your family, your friends and your country. By coming together, we can all play a part in helping the country to overcome this virus. Absolutely. Very well said. You're inspiring, like I said, millions who are listening to you and millions who will listen to you overall again when we post this on our social media. Thank you so much, Shahad Abdul Razak, for speaking to us. It was such a pleasure and I'm quite inspired as well. Okay, we were hosting Shahad Abdul Razak, like I told you earlier. Combating COVID-19 is a shared responsibility and the Information and E-Government Authority is encouraging the community to play an important role in the process. IGA expresses its appreciation to these 30 volunteers who work alongside its team to spread awareness on Be Aware app. And in case you have not yet downloaded, then you should be doing it right away the minute you stop your car or the minute you get off the work that you have been doing because this is one application which is going to really help you in combating the spread of COVID-19. Let's move on.